Hello everyone. Today I have a beautiful card idea to share with you that showcases a fun way to use some of your thinlet dies. This particular card showcases the butterfly thinlets and it is just simply gorgeous. I call it the little swash and squash technique because we're going to be using the little swash image from the work of art stamp set and of course we are going to squash it onto the butterfly. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is you want to cut your pieces uh, before you get started with any stamping. So I already cut the little butterfly out. I used, again, I used the little butterfly thinlets. And for this card, you might have noticed that I actually rounded the corners. I used this fabulous new punch. And you can round the corners of your paper and you can round the corners of your card, your entire card. All you do is just simply slide it in and push down. And I did this all the way around my um, cardstock here that I'm going to be using for the stamping. And then I also did the same thing with my card base. So for this particular card, I used some Smoky Slate cardstock for the card base. And then I also used a piece of Whisper White, which is cut to five and a quarter by four inches. There. So now we've prepped our cardstock. So I'm going to set this to the side. And then I'm going to do my stamping on here. So the first thing I want to do is I want to adhere my butterfly to this cardstock with just a couple of glue dots. So I'm going to do that first. And this will prevent your butterfly from moving as you do your stamping. And also you're going to be stamping directly over the butterfly, so it's great to have it adhered right to the card. Now you can adhere it straight on. I kind of put it a little bit on an angle. So we're just going to stick that on and then we're going to use this little swash type image from the Work of Art stamp set. I'm going to use three different colors. So we're going to start with pink and I'm just going to ink up my stamp and I'm going to stamp directly over the butterfly like that. And I want to clean my stamp off and grab the next color. So for this card, I used the pink, yellow, and blue, but you can really use any colors that you prefer. So this one is the yellow, so we'll just stamp that. And then this we're going to go just below the pink. And then for the blue, we are going to go just below the yellow. Here is our blue. And that's it. Pretty simple. Then just for the finishing touch, you can add a little sentiment. And I'm going to use the sentiments that came right in the Work of Art stamp set. But you can put any sentiment on it that you prefer. And I'm going to use the Smoky Slate um, since that is the color that I used for the background. And I'm just going to stamp a little thank you on the top and on the bottom. And that's it. All right, there you have it. A beautiful little butterfly card, very simple to do. Um, all you need is some kind of swooshy type image and the Work of Art stamp is perfect for it. So I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial. Thank you for watching.